Secretary of State John Kerry arrived in Mexico on Wednesday, meeting with his counterpart, Mexican Foreign Minister Jose Antonio Meade. It's a part of a high-level economic dialogue aimed at strengthening the ties between the two North American partners. CCTV's Frank Contreras joins us live from Mexico City with the latest. That's right, Mike. Thanks. Mr. Kerry's visit is the first one he's making now to uh, the United States neighbor right to the south. Mexico, of course, it's a major and important relationship. And what we're seeing here is a shift in focus, a major shift taking place under the presidency of Enrique Peña Nieto. As you recall, Mike, in the previous administration under Felipe Calderón, the president at that time, Mexico was focusing almost entirely on the issue of security because of widespread drug-related violence. But because of today's meeting, we can see the shift is starting to move towards things like education and the economy. Of course, trade is all always a main issue. And today, Mexico's finance minister, Luis Videgaray, said that Mexico's trade relationship is valued at, get this, Mike, $1 million per minute. Wow, that really puts things into perspective. Uh, let's talk a little bit about the economy. Mexico's central bank today lowering its GDP growth forecast. It was in the 3 to 4 percent range. Now it's more 2 to 3 percent. A sluggish economy can affect many things, including security. So what are both the United States and Mexico planning to do to improve things there? Well, they're starting to take the long view on issues of this sort. And so what they're looking at are things like university-related education programs, projects aimed at expanding the exchange programs already available in both countries. Already there are 14,000 Mexicans studying in the United States every year and 4,000 Americans studying here in Mexico. We want both numbers to grow. President Obama has set a target of 100,000 students going each way between the United States and Mexico, Central America, Latin America. Sweeping education reforms are among the major changes taking place under this administration of Enrique Peña Nieto, Mike. Other changes include uh, constitutional reforms in telecommunications and things like energy, for example, opening Mexico's almost completely sealed state-owned oil company to foreign investment. The Mexican government says this creates opportunities here south of the United States border for the opportunity for the country to expand its social programs and improve its, its economy as well. And so these are the kinds of issues that uh, both governments are looking at now as they meet. The uh, meetings between the Secretary of State and his counterpart, Mr. Meade, here in Mexico will continue on Thursday. Day, Mike. All right, Frank Contreras, live for us in Mexico City. Can't thank you enough.